guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited. I have a Dollar Tree Christmas haul for you guys. Um, I have one, two, three, four, five bags to go through. Uh, I am so excited. I've been, um, I've gone a couple times down to the Dollar Tree um, because, oh, I have a decal on my boot. Um, I've been trying to slowly, oh, you want to show them the bag? Okay, come here. I'm gonna show them. So look. <laughs> um, I'm my little helper here. Um, I wasn't. Whoa. whoa. You okay? Sure. Okay. Come here. Um, I wasn't sure if I was gonna actually film this. Can you put it right here? You wanna help show them with me? You wanna help them? Ready? Let's talk for a second. Um, I wasn't sure when I was gonna film this haul. Um, I think this is gonna be like part one for me. Um, because if you know anything about the Dollar Tree, you know around Christmas time, around any holiday, you have to keep going. You have to keep checking, you have to keep going. Um, there's a few things that I still want. Sorry if you hear him. Uh -huh. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Um, there's a few things that I still want to get and I have not been able to find. Um, there's a few things that I've been still eyeing and I cannot find. Um, but I'm just going to keep going. I'm going to keep going and I'm going to keep looking. Um, and I will try to film a few more for you guys. Um, but I'm gonna show you everything I've gotten so far. There's a lot of beautiful things that I have not gotten just because I don't feel like I have a need for it. I also got some wrapping paper. Um, Two of the wrapping papers are actually at my mom's house right now because they are wrapping paper and they're like special. Um, so they're hiding at my mom's house and then I have about four rolls outside of the garage. I will go grab it and show you guys um, by the end of the video. Hopefully I remember. Um, but Dollar Tree wrapping paper is my favorite around the holidays because it's just, it's so good. Such pretty prints. They have such beautiful prints for just a dollar. Um, Landon, um, my oldest favorite store is literally the Dollar Tree, so he's always going. And then I always go too just because I love the Dollar Tree. I love, love just walking through it and finding something new. So we are going to get started with my newest one. This is actually the one I went to today. Um, and I got a few things. Um, so the first thing I grabbed, First thing I grabbed were these wired garland ties. Um, so I grabbed two of them. They have 12 pieces in each, but I'm not sure how many I'm gonna need. So I just got two of them. Um, I thought these would be great because I do have a banister, a banister um, this year with like the iron spindles. So I want to wrap garland up, up it. So I grabbed these so I can tie it up because I've always wondered like what do you do? I know most people do zip ties, which is great, but I think this will help cover up the zip ties but I may be able to just use this. So we will see, I've never done it before. Um, so we shall see, so I got two of those. Next thing I got was this, and I actually already opened it up. It is the wrapping paper cutter. There's a two pack. Um, it's, um, the one on top is green and this one's red. It's great just to like zip up the wrapping paper. Um, so I got that. Oh, I guess I'll show you guys. Um, <laughs> my oldest is doing um, a Thanksgiving party at school and they ask for donations of Chex Mix and Dollar Tree has Chex Mix so they have great Chex Mix. So I actually got four bags because there's only a dollar and at Walmart it's way more expensive. So I got four bags to donate. I don't know what they're doing. They're doing like Chex Mix, popcorn, and M&M's and then something else. Um, popcorn, M&M's, Chex Mix. And I forget what the last thing is but that's what they want so they must be doing like some kind of mix. Um, and the next thing I got were these little cute snowman um, napkins. There's 20 in here. I thought these were really cute to like throw into my old lunchbox. We always do like fun um, napkins for lunch. And these are always so cute. I showed, I showed them. Thank you. You want to show them these? So I actually found these. I thought these would be a really cute stocking stuffer. Um, they are tattoos. Uh, whoa. Hold on. Hold on. I got these ones. They're tattoos. I thought it would be a good stocking stuffer. This one is Tonka, it's 25 pieces, and this one's Paw Patrol, and it is also 25 pieces, um, and it just looks like this, you can tell. and this one just looks like this. I thought that'd be really cute, like I said, a little stocking stuffer, um, kind of add into their stockings. Um, they love tattoos, so that's what I got today. Got a few other things, but those are um, not Christmas stuff. I showed it, baby. Napkin, snowman, say snowman, snowman. <laughs> All right, next thing. I got these 60-piece 
um, gift tags. Um, I thought these were really cute. Can't go wrong with gift tags, and I feel like for a buck, these are actually really, really cute. I love the little camper in a Christmas tree. Check out those. I honestly don't even think I needed gift tags this year, but I like to change them up. I feel like I'm always reusing the same ones or like using the same stickers that I've had for years now. So the next thing I grabbed were four of these popcorns. Um, and I thought these would be really fun. It is Sweet Chaos Delightful um, Disruptive Drizzled Popcorn and Peppermint Crunch. It is just with sweet white and dark frosting. Um, and it is gluten free. It's made with cane sugar and sea salt. There's no high um, fructose corn syrup. Um, and there's no artificial flavorings. Um, so I thought, and it's also popped in coconut oil. So I thought that these would be a really cute teacher gift. Um, so Landon actually has technically so the teacher, two teacher aides, and then there's like the main person who's like, I think she's more like admin, but she sometimes helps in the classroom. She helps in check ins and check outs too. So I want to give her a gift as well. Um, so I got four of them, and I'm gonna make a little little. Um, and I have the bags to show you, too. like little like goodie bags for them. I'm gonna make little goodie bags for them, and I thought these would be really cute to add into their um, Christmas bags, um, holiday bags. I don't know. I'm probably gonna write this Happy Holidays because like I don't. I'm I'm assuming it's Christmas. We're doing a Christmas. Um, I'm assuming they celebrate Christmas. We're doing a Christmas um, like a play thing that they're doing at Landon School, but I don't know if, I don't know, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna say happy holidays to be safe. So you just never know nowadays. So next thing I grabbed, actually, I'll show you this next. So um, to go off of those popcorns, I ended up grabbing these gift bags. I love Dollar Tree gift bags. You cannot beat their pricing. Um, just be a little careful. Sometimes like the ribbon will rip or something, like the handles, just be careful. Um, but I got, two, there was two packs of two for a dollar. Um, so I ended up getting four. Um, it's red with yellow or gold, Merry Little Christmas, and then the white with red, Merry, uh, Merry and Bright. Um, I don't know, like I said, I shouldn't make great Christmas, but I feel like, I don't know. Um, so I got two of those, so I got a total of four for $2, so can't go wrong with that. And then, I don't know if they're doing anything with their friends at school, but I decided, I think no matter what, I'm going to. Um, and if they don't, Landon can still give them to his class. Um, like, I'm sure his teachers will still let him give it to his class. Um, so I grabbed these because, you know, for October, I didn't know we were going to do anything. This is Landon's first time being in school. I'm, I've never had a kid in school before, so I don't know, right? But um, last minute, they ended up saying, like, oh, you can bring, like, goodies and, like, so that they can switch, whatever. Didn't know that until literally, like, two days before. So I was like, great. Um, and no stores had anything. So I'm being prepared um, so this time I ended up getting these. I was going to do the little like Claire bags and have like, little treats in it, but I thought this would be so much cuter. Um, so they're three gift bags um, for a dollar. They're like this small. So I thought it'd be perfect to add like little treats into it and stuff. Oh, this one's broken already. Oh, no, it's not. I just have to fix it. Um, so there's three and I got this one. It's like blue. And then I got this one and it's little snowman, snowman, snowman. Santa and snowman and then I got this one with little penguin little polar bear and reindeer um, and then these ones I got they're the same thing so the snowman the Santa and a snowman and then another one of those um, so I got enough to make 15 wait, 3 6 9 12 15 yeah 15 there's 14 kids in this class so perfect um, so, that's what I got. And so off of that, I also found these at the Dollar Tree. Um, I know I got these last year for my kids and they seem to like it. It's just the lollipops. It is artificially flavored and the wrapping has the design on it. But this one is Gingerbread Man and the snow, uh, Santa Claus. And then I got two of the Snowman and trees. I thought that these would be cute just to add into like their little baggies. I don't know again. What else I'm going to be putting in there? I haven't found anything. Because um, I want to be wary. I don't want to just give them a lot of candy. So next thing I grabbed were these Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer um, mini candy canes in blue raspberry and cherry. So I thought these would be really cute. Again, I just had to shove them back in there because my ash was taking them out. Um, just to kind of toss into the little baggies. I'm going to try to do something else. I want lollipops and candy canes and then that's it. More candy. 
Um, I need to find like other little like Christmas stuff that I can throw in there. Um, and then I'm gonna do that too. I'm also gonna like look up on Pinterest maybe like some little like things that to give kids for Christmas for like school and stuff. I don't know. We'll figure it out together. Okay, I'll keep you guys updated. Um, so next thing I found were these um, little mini lights. This is a 20 count mini lights. It's five feet long. This is indoor use only. Um, there's steady burning or flashing. Um, it's green wire, um, non-connectable, so you can only use one. Um, but I thought this would be perfect because I ended up getting the boys a little like three foot tree um, to put in their room. Landon talked me into it at Hobby Lobby. <laughs> um, but I think we still find the boys share a room. They have bunk beds and they have like a little corner in the room that we have like a giant like bear in. But I think I'm going to move the bear and then put our his little Christmas tree in there so the boys can decorate it together. And I think it'll be so fun um, just to have like that memory for them. And I'm, I want to have like a Christmas tree in every corner of my house. So um, I thought this would be cute. I heard people talk really good things about these dollar tree um, lights. They look promising. Um, so we shall see. Um, we'll see. I guess, um, stay tuned for a decorate with me and see how they work. <laughs> um, but I got those. Um, next thing I got, I actually got a few of these, but they're put away. I only have one out now. Um, but these are the chalkboard tags. Um, they are cardboard. These are great. I actually last year used them as, um, name tags for our stockings. And I just put everyone's name on it. And it was like the part that hung with our stocking. It was super, super cute. I actually sold a bunch last year with decals on it. Um, but this year I grabbed a few, um, cause I think I'm going to make something special for the teachers with their names on it. Not sure yet. Or I may just use it for, um, just our normal, like, gift tags. So, got those. These I'm so excited for. This is actually one of the first Christmas things that I found at the Dollar Tree this year. Um, and I got this, like, beginning of October. Uh, and it's these bottle brush trees. These are gorgeous. They have like a wood bottom. This looks like something that would sell for like $3 at Target. And I got it for a dollar. Um, I only, there's only like, I think like five and I'm kind of regretting not picking up more of them. And my mom was mad at me too. She's like, I wish you bought me some. Like, I didn't know. Cause like my mom's not a huge Dollar Tree fan. She doesn't like the Dollar Tree, she doesn't go in there. And then she sees things like this and she's like, why did you buy me? And I'm like, I don't know. Like you said, you don't like the Dollar Tree. So I don't know. Um, but these are gorgeous. They have like this faux, um, uh, snow on them um, of the, what is that called? Flock. Um, I think I'm going to spray these with hairspray um, just to make sure that they don't shred, uh, shed too much. Uh, but they are gorgeous. I love these so much. I think I'm going to put them like, next to my uh, fireplace. Uh, I think they're gorgeous, but if I'm going to, if I find more, I will get more. This is from Hobby Lobby, but I'll show you guys anyway. See so our Hobby Lobby and they were $3.99 and I got them for 50% off. So they're almost a dollar. So if you go to Hobby Lobby, find these. Um, these are the Merry Little Christmas ornaments. There's four of them. Again, it was $3.99 and I got it for 50% off. Um, and these are for the boys for their bedrooms. Um, Christmas tree, since it, they have a dinosaur themed bedroom, I thought those would be really cute. And then I also found these ones. It's another four count. Um, it was $3.99 and 50% off. And it's just like this. It's another dinosaur yeah. print. Um, it's basically a dollar. So go to Hobby Lobby. They have the cutest mini ornaments. And then even, even the tree that I got for their bedroom. It was like a $20 tree and it was 50% off. So I got it for only $10. So it was perfect. It was really easy for Landon to persuade me with that tree because it was 50% off. $10. Like sure, I'm going to get you a tree for your room. Um, but next thing I got was actually this at the Dollar Tree. Um, it is, oh my God. Oh, thought it didn't work for a second. It's because I bought it new. Um, it's just a little tree topper for their room. I thought it was really cute. They had this one like every year, I'm pretty sure. Um, so I got that one. I thought it was really cute. I found these mini ornaments at the Dollar Tree. It's t uh, 16 pieces and I got it in blue and it's like the mini ones. Again, I think it looks just really cute in their bedroom for their Christmas tree. Um, next thing I found, oh, their ornaments are my favorite. I always end up grabbing one every year. So I found this one and it just looks like this. It's Happy Holidays. It's such a pretty like white wood look that has the pretty bow and I just thought it was so cute. It's actually pretty big um, and for a dollar I thought it would be like a really pretty piece for my Christmas tree. I got that. Next thing I grabbed were to make snow globes. So if you remember Dollar Tree, they used to have the snow globe last year but they were much smaller 
These are a lot bigger. Um, and so I got two of them because we're going to DIY some snow globes. And I thought it would be really cool um, toddler activity for me and boys to do. So we grabbed these. Um, and I also grabbed material to do it. So I grabbed these snow globes, super cute. Um, and they're really, really big, like really big. Um, and then I also grabbed two things of this faux snow in white. And it just looks like this. So I grabbed two of them for both snow globes. I also grabbed two things of baby oil from the Dollar Tree to throw into the snow globe. And I'm gonna mix this with water if needed. Probably one of these, one water. Um, I didn't want to do just fully baby oil just because I feel like then it's gonna be like just really slow. Um, so I'm gonna mix it with half water, half baby oil for each of them. And it was only a dollar. You probably can honestly get baby oil a little bit cheaper at Walmart. Also for the snow gloves, I found these mini little, um, what is it called? Bottle? I just said it too. Bottle brush, bottle brush treat. You know what I'm saying. I got these things. They're little mini ones. They're super cute. I'm probably gonna glue it in the inside of it, um, like a few. But I'm also I need to find some other things that I want to put into them. Um, not sure yet. But that's what I got. That's everything I've gotten so far at the Dollar Tree. So I wanted to show you guys oh let me get my wrap so this is the wrapping paper that i got um it's really pretty little truck with the tree and little trees in the background i thought it was really pretty so you get 40 square feet in this um which is great and it also has grid lines so if you need the grid lines to cut this has it uh, so i got four of these and then i also got um the i think it's spider-man and then the mickey mouse so each boy has their own he has no idea what I'm saying. No. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that is what I got at the Dollar Tree this far. Um, so I have a lot more to go look for. Um, I want to get a brand new tree for downstairs. So I'm really excited. Um, trying to persuade my husband a little bit more. Um, but hopefully I can get a new tree for down here. If not, my tree will make do. We should have really high ceilings in this house. So I want like a taller tree. We shall see. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this little Dollar Tree haul. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. We are so close to hitting a thousand. Um, I was hoping to hit a thousand by the end of 2021, but then I ended up taking like a whole month off because, you know, mental health and me and the boys just got really, really sick. It was an awful month for us. So I'm, I'm, I'm back on it. We are going to film. We are going to upload. We are going to edit. We got this. So... I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.